Hi folks, this is Daily Spirit for Youth, a daily devotional that helps you grow closer to God and apply His Word to your life. Today's reading entitled, Expectations Become Idols, written by Pastor Johannes Putra Pratama, is based on Numbers chapter 21 verses 4 to 9. I will read verse 9. So Moses made a bronze snake and put it up on a pole. Then when anyone was bitten by a snake and looked at the branch snake, they lived. Have you ever been at a food stall and complained that the chili sauce ran out when you tried to add it to your bowl of soup? Or have you ever mumbled when the office boy at work comes to bring your meatballs with scallions even though you told him not to put scallions on them? Have you? In our daily lives, it's not uncommon for us to mumble as a sign of dissatisfaction when reality doesn't meet our expectations. In today's passage, the Israelites were complaining to God through Moses. Complaining is indeed a natural thing, but they were complaining to God when they had just been given victory over the Erodites. God saw that the Israelites were beginning to put their own desires and expectations first. So God gave them punishment in the form of deadly venomous snakes. The people realized that they had gone against God. Hearing the people's plea for forgiveness, God asked Moses to make a bronze snake statue and put it on a pole. The statue of the snake that had to be looked at so that the person bitten by the snake could stay alive became a symbol of how important it was to prioritize God and maintain focus on His guidance so that the people could always live righteously. Folks, the story of the Israelites reminds us. Our complaints about simple things could be a sign that we are beginning to be controlled by our expectations. Expectations have become idols in our hearts. If that's true, then repent. Look back to God and His guidance. Ponder these questions. How did God rebuke the people of Israel for complaining? When was the last time we put desire before truth? Please share your thoughts in the comment section below or you can comment on other people's thoughts. Now let us pray. Dear Lord, teach us to focus on you and your guidance. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you feel blessed through this devotional, please like this video and share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel to receive blessings every day. God bless you. Music